today we will be doing lesson exercise for unit 6 lesson 5 a place for everything and everything in its place so the first picture we can see is of a refrigerator fridge is the short form for the word refrigerator and the things that are out of place here are a shirt this is a shirt which is kept in the refrigerator and scissor so this is a scissor now let's look at the study table and this is a study table so what is out of place a clothes hanger and a sock these two things are out of place the other two pictures this is a dining table so what is out of place a ball and a book and in this closet wardrobe cupboard what is out of place you can see eggs here and you can see cake here so in this wardrobe cupboard cake and eggs are out of place let's write them over here so that's right so we will put in this wardrobe eggs and cake so you will know to mark it in your textbooks in the dining table what is out of place let's make this a little bigger here ball and book in the refrigerator let's write shirt and scissors and in the study table we have clothes hanger and sock so we have answered the first question second question which says which of the things in these pictures don't belong there we have already written this this second question say where you will put them describe each picture in one or two lines let's complete this now so we will see the shirt and the scissors shirt will go in the cupboard scissors will go on the study table clothes hanger and sock both will go in the cupboard eggs and cake will go on the dining table the ball will go in the toy basket the book will go on the study table now let's write two or three sentences about them describe each picture in one two two lines so for the first one we will write this is a refrigerator there are many food items in it there are milk bottles kept in it there are fruits and vegetables in it next one this is a study table there are many books on it there is a green lamp on the table let's go for the next this is a dining table there are many utensils on the table there is food kept on the table there are plates and spoons on the table. The fourth one. This is a cupboard. There are many clothes inside the cupboard. There are shoes kept inside the cupboard. So in this way you can write one or two lines describing the each picture. Now we have to remember we don't have to describe what is a fridge and why it is used. We have to describe each picture picture so what we can see in the picture like we can see the fridge with the food in it we can see the table with the food and the plates in it we can see the study table with the books we can see the cupboard with the clothes so you have to describe the 
picture you do not have to describe the thing so you must remember this is the reason we are writing about what we can see in the picture and using these sentences as a guide you can make your own sentences or mix and match these sentences and use them to complete your lesson exercise please do keep liking subscribing and commenting and if there is anything you want us to cover teach please do let us know in the comment section thank you so much do remember to like share subscribe and click the bell icon to stay updated on all of the latest videos please let us know in the comment section below what other lessons you would like us to make we would love to hear from you thank you for watching